welcome back to Prince Yawi TV and today I'm going to discuss about the short overview on the module Empowerment Technologies Quarter 4 Module 1 entitled Multimedia and ICT so before anything else uh, I would like to share the copyright disclaimer under section 101 107 of the copyright act 1976 allowance is made for fair use the content of these videos is strictly for educational and information purposes and is not intended to be advice or recommendation of any kind whatsoever. Any pictures and content of these modules are owned by rightful owner or writer under Region 7 Cebu Province Division. So let's start. So this is a module and let's start with the what I know. So here there is a 10 items uh, multiple choice item for what I know so you will write the what I know on, on the Microsoft Word and, uh, okay. Okay, so you read and understand the question on the 10 items multiple choice on what I know. So there are 10 item questions. So you copy the... What I know. Okay. Okay, you copy the title of what I know and in on the Microsoft Word and then answer the multiple choice items test. So after the multiple choice after uh, item test, let's answer what's in. So here you will um, name the images shown in the box below. Here, so this uh, is the image, and you will name the items in the box. So you will write the name of each. Um, picture on the separate sheet of paper okay next is what's new uh, as a user of digital tool in your opinion what is a simple yet functional usability so as a user of digital tool it could be cell phone computers or any digital tools in your own opinion what is the simple yet functional usability okay so after you answer what's new we will move on to the discussion part what is it so we will discuss here the difference between web, web 2.0 web 3.0 and user participation in the web so here we need to divide the uh, in the table there are the differences of web 1.0 2.0 and 3.0 in web 1.0 the mostly read only web and web 2.0 the widely read right web and trip web 3.0 the portable personal web so you will read the discussion for the content the rich content in online environment and user interface the gi metal media interactive the online tools like facebook live youtube editor youtube live streaming like uh, i do so youtube live streaming adobe spark Majesto, Facebook Slideshow, Lobster, and Video. Periscope, UV Video, Stories, Ads.com, and Animoto. So these are examples of the online tools to produce video content. 
and letter B online games test and ka course wares online games online test online course wear and another content is all about web game pod and broadcasting webcast is a media file distributed over the internet using streaming media technology webcast uses streaming media technology to take a single shot or content source and distribute it to many simultaneous listeners or viewers like what i do today so gamecast is a hook for some functionality that will be able in the future and what is does in send play by play data to our web server podcast also no, another is an episodic series of digital audio or video files which a user can download and listen to and next is the benefits of broadcasting uh, content on demand your video content on demand uh, easier and cheaper than TV production allows for skills and delivery convergence a new newspaper can be an online broadcaster and a broadcaster can be an online newspaper flexible mass distribution much easier and little no cost for maker or consumers no copies to be made and distributed because it is online using video and mm, next is what's more so evaluate web pages is the activity the, the learner will choose one website and attach the screen capture to the home page your chosen website and evaluate it using the criteria below so if you find an, a website any website that you are interested you copy the URL like this the URL paste it here and the screen picture of the website you will post it here so that's the what's more activity so you will do the what's more activity in in choosing or viewing a website and write the name of it and then copy the URL and paste the sculpture uh, capture the or screenshot the interface of the website okay so here are the the criteria to evaluate the features of site carefully after you paste the website and you will evaluate here okay uh, before I'm going to discuss the evaluate I would like to uh, acknowledge the eh? shout out sata, shout out for grade 12 students or viewers uh, please download the link uh, for the module below and shout out sa ko sa Brad na ko ang classmates pag high school uh, boy pakals nanitabang na ko to, to increase more subscribers so also I uh, would like to say thank you guys sa uh, atong admin sa group premiere Janjan Vlogs, uh, Ga Glads and Travel Photography so keep on watching guys uh, I'm going to uh, plug your channel on my upcoming video sa mga wana tawag ang members sa premier group akong i uh, plug in yung hang mga uh, YTC so on my upcoming video so please uh, stay tuned and uh, sa wala pa naka subscribe sa akong channel uh, please go subscribe sa lower right portion and click the notification bell to be updated on my videos okay to continue so evaluate the features of the site carefully afterwards rate from 1 to 10 to state the reasons here is 1 to 10 then state your reasons here under comment then there's a criterion uh, example overall look for a website overlook of the overall look for the website this is look professional so you will rate it 1 to 10 and then comment if you want to suggest something on the website so follow the the format and then write uh, answer the essay write the strength and weaknesses of the website and write the features that should be present and removed from the website if you'd like to add a f features on the website uh, please write here and if you want to remove please do comment also then next part is what i have learned so in this part you will explain the organizational chart below based on what you have understood so based on the so readings earlier you will answer the what have you learned so these are the organizational uh, chart so you will discuss uh, user participation of 1.0 web 1.0 and one web 2.0 and web 3.0 
So we will discuss the your game's email chart, the online environment, which content, and user experience. So we will discuss the chart in the part of what I have learned and in what I can do. So you will answer this question again. Write your answer in a separate sheet of paper. Uh, what is the important to create an online environment and is close to one to what we have currently having so importance of online environments uh, and then follow answer also the question number two and the next part is the assessment uh, matching type so here um, match the multimedia and ICD terms in column A and in column B so you match based on its uh, definition, write the letter and space provided. So aside from writing the letter and space provided, you'll write the letter on separate sheet of paper. This copy first the question from column A and then answer directly column B. So that's it. That's the assessment part. And the last part is the additional activities. Um, identify what is being asked, write your answers on a separate sheet of paper. So, definition of terms. So, there are five questions on additional activities. So, just research, or you can find the answers on the readings uh, above and then answer the terms here. So, next is the answer key. So, that's it. So, that's the parts of the module for grade 12 empowerment technology, module 1, quarter 4. Okay, so if you have questions, just comment in the live chat or comment on the comment section below and I will answer your question later. And then there is also a download, download link below to download the soft copy of the module. Okay, uh, since the hard copy will be printed with delayed so please uh, download the soft copy in advance so that you can answer in advance also the module one for quarter four so again thank you so much everyone for staying and for watching the short overview of the module empowerment technologies so thank you so much and see you on my next uh, live